Congratulations on your purchase of FlexShade Zip Motorized Shades by Draper Incorporated. This video will cover several advanced programming tasks. Please note, the following procedure requires you to be in user mode and should only be performed after the initial limit setting is complete. To view limit setting instructions, please see the previous video in this series. If you wish, you can skip ahead to the time codes on screen or use the links in the description below. To put the shade into user mode, press the programming button on the back of the remote until the motor jogs. Move the shade to the desired midpoint location. Then press the My slash Stop button until the motor jogs. To test the newly programmed intermediate position, move the shade to any position and stop it. Press the My slash Stop button. The shade will move to the intermediate position. To delete an intermediate stop, deploy the shade to the stop you wish to remove. Hold the My slash Stop button until the motor jogs. This position has now been deleted. Select the motor's current channel, and then hold the programming button until the motor jogs. Next, select the new channel to add to the motor, and then hold the programming button until the motor jogs. The motor should now work on both the old and the new channels. Select the channel that you want to keep operating the motor, and then hold the programming button until the motor jogs. Select the channel to remove, and hold the programming button until the motor jogs again. The motor should now only work on the channel kept from the previous step. Move the motor to the limit that you want to be changed. The shade must move to the previously set limit and will stop automatically. If this doesn't happen, the limit is not set. Next, simultaneously hold the up and down buttons until the motor jogs. Finally, move the motor to its new limit location and press the my slash stop button until the motor jogs. To reset any motor, disconnect the power for 5 seconds and then reconnect to power for 15 seconds. Disconnect the power for another 5 seconds and then reconnect to power and leave connected. The shade should roll down a few inches and stop. Finally, hold the programming button for 15 seconds. The motor will jog up and down once, then pause and then jog a second time. The motor is now reset and ready to be programmed. This function allows you to deactivate or adjust the sensitivity of the obstacle detection setting during the downward operation of the shade. To begin, start with the shade at the halfway position. Simultaneously press the My and Up buttons once briefly and then again for two seconds. The shade will then jog, indicating that it's ready to be programmed. You will only have 10 seconds to press the up or down buttons to increase or decrease the level of object detection sensitivity. When left idle for more than 10 seconds, the shade will revert to user mode. If you wish to adjust the sensitivity further, you will need to repeat the process from the beginning. This concludes advanced programming for the FlexShade Zip motorized shade system featuring Somfy RTS motors. If you need further assistance, please contact your dealer or call Draper Inc at 765-987-7999.